Welcome back to Factory Town, folks. We are producing way more pickaxes than we need, so we're going to fix that because I have figured out how this stuff works. Well, I kind of knew how it worked, but I just got them, right? So we're going to say less than, let's say, 50. All right, so we need another which is I want a logic lamp and we need another which is a inventory sensor there it is all right so the inventory sensor is we're going to offset this is what I had forgotten I'd forgotten that I needed to offset this so we're going to say pickaxes and then we're going to hook you up to there we're going to hook you up to there and we're going to hook you up to there and that should do it. So now there is more than 50 in there. There's actually quite a lot. So this grabber is now off. And once we get to less than 50, then it will turn on and let out some pickaxes. So let's just, for testing purposes, set this to 95. And let's see what happens when this picks up. So there's 95 and it's still turned off because it's less than, it's not less than or equal to. Now we're down to 94 and this thing is letting out pickaxes like it's nobody business. Good. And then once these pickaxes start coming in here, it will stop again. So let's, let's just check that it's going to do that. All right. So we're down to 92, now we're up to 95, and there we go. This is now off. Good. Well, we're going to set this back down to 50, and that works. Fantastic. So we can control our output that way. And for now, I want to get the rails going over here. And I want to get some reinforced planks as well, which we are not actually producing for sales purposes just yet. Where is it that we are producing reinforced planks? We're not there. Are we producing reinforced planks? I think we are somewhere. Yeah, we are because we're producing them for pickaxes. So we could actually do the same here and we could get these going out and going over to somewhere where we can sell them. So put them on here somehow. So let's do that. So we're going to need this once again. We'll need an adventure center. We'll need a logic lamp and copy that uh, can I copy that there okay uh, less than 50 and we are going to hook that up to somewhere we don't know where yet but this is going to be Connect it to over there as well. And it's going to have a filter of reinforced planks. And connect to over there. This is going to connect to there. And then, whoops, we just need to get this output going somehow. And that shouldn't be too hard. So we'll just come up here like so. And we'll put in a grabber there. And we will hook this in this up to that. Oops. Okay. And so we have a ton of those going now. And once we have 50 in here, we'll stop and all will be fine and dandy. We're up to 77 here, 
and but we aren't producing any right now. This is stopped. Oh, so that's good. Okay, and we are getting our reinforced planks in here quite rapidly. And this is now full, so it will start filling up here, which is good. And all will be just fine. Very, very nice indeed. Very, very nice indeed. Okay, and these are still going strong, but as soon as it hits 50, it'll shut down and we'll be happy. All right? Good. So we want these guys to go as well. And I think eventually I'll change all of this output down here to being a rail system. But for just now, I just need to make some red coins. And I don't have, well, I suppose I do have the rails to do it, but I haven't built this up yet. The whole cloak production line, which I think I'm going to move over here and then we'll somehow have rails for this going over, dropping off here. And that's all good. And then, my thinking is over here, I actually want uh, cargo boats for all our apothecary stuff to come along, going over here. Up here, we'll stick with belts. And over here, we will go rails as well. We could also, just to have four different delivery met methods, we could go rails over here. Wagons and caravans or caravans and, or something like that down here boats over here and the What's it called? Conveyor belt over here that could actually be a possibility That could be a possibility and we need to do this whole logic setup for All of them right because you can see up here. We have so many sandwiches, it's ridiculous, and we can't actually get any cake right now. But we have one. But the food market is... Uh, it's struggling a little bit for cakes. It's struggling for cakes. And everything else is doing fine. But veggie stew will soon be not fine. So yeah. We need we need to do this for all of it. And it's the same over here. Look at all this. We're completely backed up because we have 250 crowns. It's a big royal family. So, yeah. So we need to fix all that up. But right now, I want to get this going. So can we just uh, do something like this? No. Why not? Okay, come over here. And we need one of these, I think. It won't go there. Why won't it go there? Rain is too steep. Okay. So go on the side there. Why won't Like that. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, no problem. I thought it was level, but it wasn't. And that's the wrong one. So let's do that. Let's see. Is it the wrong one? Let's just double check here because I want the one that gives me the most red coins. Uh, so let's have a look at value. So metal conveyor belt gives a lot more red coins. Well, six more red coins than pickaxes. So it is actually the right one. All right. So we'll stick this down and we will put in a grabber here. And then we'll make the same logic and we'll put it down here as well. So let's put in a math block, actually. I want to 
copy you and why is it not copying the values i think there is a way to copy the values that's for sure uh, okay let's just copy you copy whoa oh, crap crap uh, you copy there there you need to be offset to there because now okay, they're not going so that's something you need to be reinforced planks and you need to be have logic there you need to have logic there and you need to have logic down there okay this is there's more than 75 so that's all fine this should work now okay you need to be offset to there you need to be metal conveyors and you need a logic link there you need a logic link there you need a logic link there okay oops and there it goes it shut it down because there's more than 50. very good there's less than 50 pickaxes so we have pickaxes on the belt right now yes we do and soon we'll have more than 50 pickaxes and then that will shut down as well. There we go. Shut down. All right. And this is off. And this is off. Perfect. This is perfect. This is going to work, guys. This is going to work. All right. So then it's cloaks that we need to move because... Quite frankly, they just don't fit over here. Well, I suppose they could. So this whole thing can actually go away. Yeah. We're just gonna remove it all. Ooh, I don't want to get rid of those boards. I want to keep those. So let's just move that warehouse down here. And we will delete all of this this whole mess here is going to go away there and we're going to delete all of these workers some scaffolding there for whatever reason and this is going to go away Okay, then we need to lower some terrain. Uh, lower some terrain, not remove resources. So get this terrain lowered. That's expensive. Uh, it's fine. Okay. Now we do need to figure out where we're going to put the rest of the town to. Because we, we basically need a town that's twice as big as this. So I'm thinking that we build it out here. Somehow. But I'm not really sure on that yet. And this I'm going to move way back. And uh, let's buy that. Wow, that's a big iron patch. And mana shard patch. Let's buy that. To where? Where would be best to do boats? Which way? Oh, let's buy that. You know what? Let's buy a bunch here. Okay. So this area is basically done. We're, we're basically not going to be doing any more here except putting in the logic stuff, which I think I'll do off camera because you've seen how it works now. Uh, and it's a little bit boring to watch, right? This whole area here with the apothecary stuff, we're going to move back and then we're going to make a canal going over here. And we're going to put in the rest of the town this way, which means that we're going to be filling in a lot of this water and making new water and stuff like that. And that's okay. 
So yeah, that's what we're gonna do. So that means that we can have a couple of farms down here uh, for our, whoops. So we need a grain farm and we need a cotton farm. Or we need a grain farm and a couple of pastures. I think that's what we're gonna do to make wool instead of cotton. Yeah, I think that makes sense. I think that makes sense. Okay, so this farm is going to move. And it's going to move over here. So we're going to have to delete those resources. So, and we don't need this anymore. So we're going to remove that and delete the forester. And delete all of this. We don't need it. So no point in having it there. All right. So then we need some farm tiles. this guy and it's gonna be a lot of grain for it I think it probably doesn't need all of the grain but we'll build it anyway because it looks, it looks nice it looks nice when it's all done like that okay I wonder why those guys are different color they changing color as they've been down there longer or something? No idea. Okay, so let's plant some grain. And get this bad boy going. All right. Almost done. There, miss any? Nope, good. And you are why are you applying water? Do you have access to water? No. So, don't apply water. Okay. Good. So, then we need to remove some resources down here. And get all of this gone. And we're going to remove these resources as well. Because I'm not going to be using them. All right. And then remove all of this stuff. Let's just clean up while we're going. There we go. Clean up this stuff. Clean up this stuff. Okay. That's that for now. Alright, we'll have a shoot going here. And it'll go into a barn. And that barn will go into the grain mill which will go into a couple of pastures one for leather and one for wool so pasture 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 there all right and you are going to make wool let's see leather takes eight seconds wool takes six seconds so we're going to make two and you need two cloth, two leather. All right, let's move you. So you need to make cloth from wool. That takes four seconds. This takes six, so this needs to be sped up a bit. And then you are going to come over Actually, let's just move you a bit because again, let's pull, put down some barns. We have a bit of a buffer if something goes wrong somewhere. So move you over there, move you mm, like that, and you like that. Okay. 
Actually, let's move you over here. We'll rotate you like that. And then we'll build another barn here and move you again like that, I think. I think that'll work. This farm can go away. All right. So, Brain, go over there. You are going to be making animal feed. Very good. And animal feed is... That can go on shoots, right? I think. Grabber. Yes, it can. There we go. You both need wells. So let's build a couple of wells. Uh, one there. One there. With some conveyor. And let's copy this grabber. Like that. Okay. So you guys are producing. Very good. Then we need to pause and do this. And we need to actually copy this again. And we need to say you only grab leather. And you only grab cotton. Or wool, sorry. There we go. And that should get that going. Very good. And then we need you to grab there, you grab there, there, and there. And we need a couple of grabbers. Copy you. There and there. And that should be it. That should be it. Why are you... Why do you have this storage? Let's uh, delete that. Right, it's because this was outputting it. Now it won't output it. And this is filling up. And this pasture here needs to be sped up quite a bit. And let's upgrade it. Upgrade it. Upgrade it. And this needs to be sped up and add air booster, I think. You have two, you have 20. Okay, so it seems like it's prioritizing this one for some reason. We need to be producing a little bit more. But which we can't right now. We can't. So let's do this. And copy this grabber. Rotate it like that. And then we'll do the same here. And there and copy. Whoa. Copy. Whoa. You copy. Why didn't it copy the grabber? Okay. You copy there. Okay. So that should help, I think. Now the farm probably can't keep up, but we can speed that up and we can even add earth booster to it. So I think we're okay. I think we're okay. You have what you need. You don't have what you need. Let's add Earth Booster. Upgrade the barn. Going up a little bit. You are full, so you're producing as fast as you possibly can. And that should be enough to supply both of these. It really should. But it's not. It is not. Slow you down a bit because you are probably... No. You're full. 
seem pretty stable. Six, seven, six, seven, six, seven. You don't have anything though. And, but you do have 11. So it seems like we're doing okay. And we are full on the cloaks. So let's delete this stuff. And then we will get it going out here. All right. Let's just get it up to height immediately and put in a grabber. So what is up to height? I wonder. Yeah, that's it. There. And we'll need the conveyor belt. And then we'll need a grabber. There. And off go the cloaks. Then all we need is this logic system for that as well. And we'll put it down here as well. So let's put in the math block. You uh, copy there. You copy. Copy there. Okay. So you offset to here. And we want cloaks. Where are the cloaks? Cloak, 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 cloak. There we go. You need to be less than 50. Very good. And you, logic there, you, logic there, you, logic there. No, you, uh, remove that link. You, logic there. Okay. Very good. You are not connected to anything, are you? You should be connected to that. All right. So there we go. We are making everything that we need up there. And everything should be just fine and dandy. Excellent. But that is going to be it for this episode, guys. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.